Hey guys, Jared Rehung in Fucking Tactical here with Springfield Armory in Las Vegas, Nevada. Springfield is giving us a first look at a new product that they're launching. It's called The Saint. Let's check it out. So we started off day one training pistol with Rob Latham, um, world class instructor, it was a great time. You'll notice I never go hunting or looking for the dot, right? Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. So that had to be right where you were aiming. First time that I've actually got some formal instruction in shooting a handgun with a um, optic mounted on top of it, a red dot, and most of them were mounted with Trigicon. Um, great instruction, um, got a lot of trigger time, some great tips on um, quick and accurate shots and multiple targets. Um, later in the day, we got a chance to do some work with the um, the actual saint itself. We're at the assembly point for the saint rifles. Each of the guys or gal has two rifles to set up. One with an MRO to set it up with a, a Surefire flashlight and a sling, which they'll be using in some close range and uh, flat drills. They're setting up a long mid-range rifle, a short mid-range rifle with a Bushnell 1 to 6.5 by 24 tactical scope. So they'll have one set up for longer range, one set up for close range. Setup time. went out on the range, we had to zero them in, we had some optics on there, um, some for more CQB optics, so one for a little, reaching out a little bit more distance, it was a six power, one to six power. Um, we played with that a little bit, got those zeros in. Saint shot well for me, I, I, my, my group was really tight, the optics just a little bit off, it's just an optic issue, we're just zeroing them in right now at a 20, zeroing it from 25 yards, but we're doing a 100 yard zero. No, Instruction again, we've got some great, great cadre here, former Delta Force operators and, and um, couldn't ask better. We went on from there to what we called the, um, the field of steel. Um, basically we had a hundred steel targets and everyone just went through with four magazines, 120, um, 120 bullets in total and everyone got a chance to time themselves how, how long it took for them to drop all 100 targets. Um, so it was a lot of fun. Um, they timed it, they actually had, uh, they gave the winner a uh, free gun, so it was a lot of fun, and that's how we wrapped up day one. So this morning we had a chance to train with Rob Pincus, a world-renowned instructor on um, defensive firearms training. The lesson that he taught us this morning was uh, based on uh, real-world defensive training scenarios. Um, we took the principles that he taught us in a relatively short period of time and he ran us through some scenarios using the uh, force on force uh, marking cartridge. Alright, so you got a significant under, best friend, your mom, your girlfriend, your wife, whoever it is, something you care about in, in the work group. Everyone got a chance to go through a couple of scenarios each and, and, and each of the scenarios was really designed for us to apply the, the, the TTPs, the techniques, tactics and procedures that he had taught in the lesson that morning. Position wise, you happy with the positions where everybody was? Big picture, you, you have to tell this story. How does lot of fun, a lot of things to be learned from that. The Bushnell uh, 1 to 6 power scope that we put on the other rifle and that was set up for some of the stuff we've been doing day two, hitting targets out to 300 meters. Everyone got their weapons zeroed in and had a chance to actually see if they could hit the targets 50, 100, 200, 300 meters today. Some people even got to shoot and hit targets out to um, 600 meters and beyond. Did anybody hear what happened as he went into the prone? It saved your life or somebody else's life. Damn.
it's coming? Have you heard anything? Um, feel of chaos. So whatever that means, um, I just saw a whole bunch of steel go by. So there's going to be a bunch of targets. It's going to be low light, and we're going to have a feel of chaos. So it sounds like fun. A lot of uh, we've got a lot of trigger time so far. Sounds like we're going to get some more. Right on. We'll see you there. See you there. I would guess we're going to be getting on helicopters. It is a surprise, but it's close back out to the program club. So, um, what lies ahead at this time is another surprise. Let's go find out what it is. All right, sounds good. We're about to go live. We want you guys to have fun. We want you to enjoy this. We want you to do something that you've never done before. Um, we're pretty sure no one's ever done this before. It's no going to be pretty ridiculous. <laughs> no one will ever probably try to even do it again. So it's, uh, but it's going to be something that will help you guys remember um, your, your first night shoot with the Saint and your first weekend with the Springfield Armory uh, entry into the AR-15. Okay guys, so that wraps it up. We just finished the feel of chaos. Hundreds of explosive targets out there that we just put thousands of rounds down range on. Had a great time. Many thanks to Springfield Armory. And I to saw you shoot Mr. at least Robert. two targets. That I, I think amazing. I might have hit two both out of them. Out of those 2,000 rounds I was, shot, I might have hit no, two they targets. They were both really well they shot. Great, I mean, it was smart shots. of you to shoot the close ones, too. I know. That's, that's all I could get there. Thanks, Rob, for um, kind of keeping me straight there. But um, a great job by Springfield Armory. Um, amazing job setting up this whole thing. Guys, look out for a great gun. Um, the Saint will be uh, coming to you soon. Thanks, guys. Yeah. <laughs>